Hi, I'm Alex Green, and we're here today to talk about the Redbeard TRE certification program. Well, Alan and I are based in Madison, Wisconsin, and together we run the Redbeard TRE certification program. And our program, we has both online only TRE certification cohorts, as well as in-person training that combines uh, in-person uh, classroom time and then online supervision. So we thought we'd just share a little bit about our backgrounds and how we use TRE in our professional practices, and then uh, some details about our program itself. So Ellen, why don't you just share a little bit about uh, you and the kind of work you're doing? Sure, yeah, so I'm Ellen. And um, here at Redbeard Somatic Therapy, um, the other arm of our, of our business that we work with together, I work with individual clients using the tools of yoga therapy, somatic education, Zen integration body work, um, TRE, and also something called SSP, which is another polyvagal um, intervention. And so in my work here, I'm working with a wide variety of clients that come to me um, for things like working with post-traumatic symptoms, um, also working with chronic pain, surgical recovery, um, injury prevention, general wellness, um, stress reduction, and many, many other things. So I use the tools in my kit to help um, support resilience, regulation, um, and well-being in my clients. And TRE, I would say, is a, a tool that at this point, almost every single one of my clients is using because of how important autonomic regulation is to basically everything else and the functioning of all the other systems of our body. So TRE is something that is used really regularly here, and I feel really honored to be able to uh, help train other people to be able to bring this into their own practices. Awesome. Yeah, so in terms of my own background, um, I'm both a uh, bodywork therapist with an, a, a background in structural integration, bodywork, and related uh, modalities like myofascial release and others. Um, and I've developed my own um, bodywork therapy program, uh, combining bodywork with uh, elements of Zen training. And uh, the other half of my practice is uh, online work using TRE, somatic experiencing. Um, uh, nervous system work, as well as the safe and sound protocol, uh, polyvagal therapy, um, and also brain spotting and uh, internal family systems work. And uh, that sounds like a lot of things, and it is, but the common theme is nervous system regulation and working from the body level uh, to support well-being, uh, personal growth, um, reduction of stress, things like that. TRE is an absolute cornerstone of the way that I work, Ellen works, and we work within our practice as a whole. Uh, what we really value about TRE is both its uh, a directness and efficiency for working directly with the body and the nervous system. Um, when we are when we're, we are using TRE in a facilitated way, there's so much that we can uh, support and provide and help uh, work towards the goals of our clients, towards regulation, stress relief, trauma recovery, et cetera. And uh, additionally, it becomes a tool that we can empower our clients to use independently for their uh, their practice. And for most of our clients, it becomes a, a skill or a tool that they're using probably for the rest of their lives. Um, so we are just big believers in, in how TRE can fit into a, a broader therapeutic practice of multiple kinds. Um, so uh, with that in mind, we, uh, we're we excited to be offering um, TRE certifications ourselves. We've been at this for, uh, I think we're into our fourth year of training. Uh, and we do programs both in person now as the pandemic has uh, started to abate and allow for that. And we've done lots of online cohorts over the last three years. I think we have done more than 30 um, classes so far in terms of groups that we've worked with, which has been uh, quite powerful. Um, we're going to share just a little bit about the structure of our program itself so that you can get a sense of the, the flow of the training. So our program is divided into three phases of learning. Um, the first phase is primarily about um, learning some of the foundational theory and the background concepts of TRE and applying it to yourself as an individual. Our belief is that by first 
emphasizing um, a deepening of your own personal practice um, is going to set you up to become a, a, a skillful uh, provider down the road. So the first phase includes an in an, uh, a live module, which is either in person or in an online learning setting as a live class where we learn those concepts and skills. And then it involves um, four personal supervision sessions that happen after that module scheduled one-on-one -on -one with you. The second phase of training is where we begin to teach you the skills and competencies associated with leading individuals safely through the TRE process. Uh, again, we meet in a, in a module setting where we learn the concepts and skills and we practice with each other. And then we go into uh, supervision that we schedule uh, independently with you uh, after that second module. Lastly, the third phase of the training is taking the skills we've learned uh, teaching individuals, and now we begin to apply those to group settings. Um, uh, another attribute of TRE is the ability to work either with individuals or groups. And so we teach you that skill and then provide the opportunity for supervised sessions um, so that you're, you've done that skill building as well. Um, in addition, there's, an, there's some other things to support your learning along the way, keeping a record of your own personal practice, um, some uh, work with book reviews, working with your peers um, as an additional part of the, the training program. Yeah, one thing I'd like to say about that additional work is that um, you know, both Alex and I have full-time private practices outside of our work as TRE trainers, and most of our trainees are also working full-time outside of the time spent in TRE training. So we've really been intentional about how we develop this so that this can fit into the full-time lifestyle that so many of us have. So um, I want to walk you through a program that we've developed, an online platform, to help ensure that that process of navigating that is as smooth and clear and effective as possible. Um, so what I'm gonna share with you is something we call the Online Academy. And this Online Academy is like your home base for training. So even before you get started with your first module, we have some tools to help support you, to orient you to the program, to make sure everything feels really clear before you show up on day one. Um, after module one, this is also where you're gonna start uh, doing things like turning in some assignments, like those journals that Alex mentioned, um, or a little reflection on how some practice teaching went. This is also where we host uh, or hold supplemental materials, um, like you know how to guide yourself through taking someone um, through the tremoring process, but also some videos to help support uh, audio and visual learning as a part of that process. So. Um, this uh, online academy is something that you're going to have access to throughout the length of your training. It's included in your tuition. Uh, and in addition to that online academy, we also offer additional support through classes. So all of our trainees have access to weekly classes that are facilitated by myself, Alex, and other TRE providers in our community. Um, and those are included in your tuition. You actually have access to 10 of those. So you have 10 opportunities to show up, be seen, and keep supporting your own tremoring practice. And through that, also support your learning for how you're going to support tremoring and other individuals. Um, so with everything that we just outlined here, our program is developed to be completed within six to 12 months, and the vast majority of our, our trainees are doing just that. Um, yeah. Yeah. And just a short comment about the, uh, the online portal. The other thing that's really nice about it, in addition to organizing all of the teaching materials, it also saves the recordings of the mm -hmm. lectures that we watch. And we're always adding to it. We're uploading a new material that's being developed by Dr. Bricelli, other additional lecture material that we're recording. Um, and so we have a one a place we can, we can keep that uh, sort of supportive educational material. Um, as well. Um, the other thing that I wanted to mention is just sort of the, the kinds of folks that come to us as students. So we, so on the one hand, we have a lot of people coming through the program that may already have some, some therapeutic background or some helping profession back, background. For example, we work with many clinical therapists and counselors, social workers, we work with coaches and uh, leadership coaches, life coaches, 
And we also work with many body-oriented folks. Both of us have that body-oriented background. Uh, we work with massage therapists and other body workers, yoga therapists, yoga teachers, um, even fitness professionals. Um, so those are some of the um, people who, who are uh, learning TRE and bringing it in as a really valuable tool to support those kinds of work. But we want to point out that um, having that pre-existing platform is not a requirement. Um, we teach our TRE certification program in a way that somebody without any background in body work or nervous system work or um, uh, coaching or mental health, uh, that we teach all the necessary information, skills, and competencies for you to become uh, a safe and effective TRE provider. The uh, the founder, Dr. David Berselli of TRE, likes to comment that some of his favorite TRE providers are the plumbers that uh, come to TRE. And what he means by that is sometimes the non-clinicians who uh, can sometimes be some of the most um, effective providers of this work. Absolutely. Yeah. So in hearing all of this, if it feels like our program may be a good fit for you, what we'd encourage you to do as a next step is to schedule a registration interview. And that's an opportunity for you to really ask um, us specific questions and just learn a little bit about more about you know, us individually and you know anything that you might need to clarify if this is the next step that you want to take in your um, relationship to TRE. So um, you can access that through our website, redbeardtre.com. And uh, we look forward to meeting you there.